Hi guys and welcome to the unboxing of the new Apple M1 MacBook Pro 13 inch. So I've got here the baseline MacBook Pro with 8GB of RAM, 256GB of SSD storage and the brand new Apple Silicon. So let's open up the box by pulling these cards away. And there we have the MacBook Pro brand. Uh, I will say I have ordered this MacBook um, within the first 10 minutes of pre-ordering, so that's the reason why I got it so early. I'll just move this away. And here it is, our first Apple Silicon MacBook. Just looking at the box. So it's MacBook Pro, nothing special. Uh, my configuration, 8 gigs of RAM, 256 gigs of SSD storage, 13 inch, 13 inch MacBook Pro. Do we have any specifics? Uh, we can see it says 8 core CPU, 8 core GPU. So that's the config of the new Apple M1 Silicon. We do have two Thunderbolts, USB 4, and that's basically it. All right, so. Now it's time, let's open up the box. So as usual, no need for additional life. So just for comparison, I do have the other 2020 MacBook Pro 13 inch, the baseline. Uh, so there is MacBook with the lid open. Now you see it again from the front, so a little difference in the package. All right, if you pull up the box, the MacBook should appear. And here it is. We do have USB-C cable, we do have the literal and the power adapter, so nothing really special there. It's down stuff, but the important stuff is this bad boy here. So as I said before, there are only two ports, like on the standard 13 inch that was already available and just the headphone check right there. And that's it, that's the unboxing of the 13 inch MacBook Pro. Uh, if you want to see any comparisons or whatever, just let me know in the comments below. Thank you guys, see you. So just a very quick comparison between the old mid-2020 MacBook Pro and the new M1 late-2020 MacBook Pro uh, Geekbench 5 score. So we see here a tremendous increase in single-core and multi-core. Those numbers are actually insane for this small device. And I guess it's even insaner if you look at the MacBook Air, with, uh, which has similar numbers. So what do you guys think of these numbers? Tell me in the comments below.